Scorpio. Hey Scorpio, welcome back to my channel. And this is the week ahead reading for the sign of Scorpio. If you're new to my channel, I pray before each and every one of my readings so that way my energy is protected, your energy is protected as well. If you're returning, thank you so much for returning. The first card we have is you can't handle the truth. So immediately I'm picking up on a masculine energy that is not being very, very emotionally expressive at this time. And they're justifying their actions by telling themselves that you can't handle the truth, okay? What, whatever this truth may be. And honestly, when people present with this energy, this is basically them saying that they are not in a position where they are ready to offer the truth. So instead of just saying that, this energy is kind of being projected as if you can't handle it. Um, honestly, there's a really, there's a heaviness with this card. So there's a lot of emotions that your person may be feeling at this time, but there's also like this underlying restrictive kind of energy as if they don't want you to know this. So this could very well be a look into their mental process. This could just very well be how they are processing the connection at this time. But whatever it is that they're truly feeling like deep down in their heart space, they feel as if you can't handle it. But whatever this is, they're really, really emotional about this. Okay, to the point where they're consumed with thoughts of you here. Um, they're very, very hyper-focused on you for some reason very, very hyper-focused on you. Even if you are at a distance from your person, I'm definitely getting like this really type of emotional energy. And this is not like a heaviness that's dark. This is just like really, really emotional. But yeah, um, they're definitely sending you some type of energy at this time. And it's like their emotions or, or it's like their imagination is kind of running wild because they don't have enough information, but they're kind of projecting this onto you. So I definitely feel like as it pertains to their mental and emotional process, they kind of feel all over the place, okay? Because their energy is coming through very, very uneasy. But one thing that's sticking out here is that they're super focused on you. So I don't know if something about them is seeming a little bit off right now. Maybe you're able to, depending on how energetically bonded you are with your person, you're able to kind of tap into their energy. You're able to really read them. Maybe you are extremely intuitive. But I'm also getting attention as well. So maybe you pay close attention to your person and you can sense the fact that there's something that's bothering them. But it's almost as if your person wants you to kind of know what this is it's, it's like they won't just say it um maybe they want you to ask them maybe they want you to initiate something here i'm not really sure but if they're mental like they're justifying this by saying that you can't handle whatever this is okay let's get the next message here yeah there's something very restrictive about this energy so it's like they don't even it's like they don't want you to know this but this could very well just be their mental process, okay? So maybe they're not verbalizing this, they're not saying this, they're not showing this, they could be very poker face, because there's restrictive energy here. So maybe this is not something that they're outwardly expressing. Maybe this is really their a look into their mental and emotional process, okay? But something about this energy feels very, very personal, very, very, you know, intimate this could be very specific as well let's get the next message here wow the next message we have is i feel your energy hmm so yeah this this masculine is very very emotional okay um and this is letting me know that you have a very powerful energetic bond with this masculine. This is someone that pays very, very close attention to you, whether you know this or not, whether you are at a distance from them, okay? 
regardless of where you are in your connection, I'm picking up a very powerful energetic bond. And pretty much your person is coming through, letting you know that they feel your energy, okay? And based upon whatever it is that they're feeling, this is kind of messing with their mind. They feel some way about this. Whatever it is that you're doing, this could be an action you're taking, this could be an inaction, this could be something you're saying, this could be something you're not saying. This is pointing to the fact that whatever it is that they're feeling is energy based and you have a very powerful energetic bond. So your person is basically coming through letting you know that based upon your energy, they're feeling some type of way, it's moving them emotionally. And maybe they want to express this, but they feel as if you won't be able to handle what it is that they have to say to you about this. This may be very, very specific, okay? Yeah, I just have a feeling this is going to be very specific. But yeah, um, as far as the energy, maybe there's been a shift in the dynamic and it's starting to really play on your person's mind right now. Um, I definitely feel like just from the energy of this reading, it really feels restrictive. I feel like this is something that they feel like deep, deep within. I feel like they have not expressed this to you. Depending on how energetically bonded you are or how intuitive you are, you maybe can pick up on your person's energy, but this is something they absolutely have not expressed. And they have not expressed this because they feel as if you can't handle what it is that they have to say. But in all actuality, I really feel as if they're not ready to address this. And this is because of the emotional heaviness of whatever this is. So let's pull some more messages to see what's going on here. Wow. So the next message we have is you've changed. Okay. So this, this is definitely starting to make sense right now. This masculine, this and this is definitely their internal process. So this is how they're currently viewing you. If you're wondering how your person is thinking about you, how they're viewing you while you're from a distance, they feel as if you have changed. They have not said this to you. You may be able to pick up on, you know, verbal cues, nonverbal cues, their actions, their energy. Um, because this, this is how they're reading you. They feel as if your energy alone is telling them that you have changed, right? And I'm picking up specifically that this is a masculine that you have a very, very deep, very close type of bond with, okay? they were used to a certain dynamic in your connection. And just recently, I feel like things have shifted. For some of you, this could definitely be an, an intentional shift. You have taken your power back, okay? You have taken control of, you know, your own emotions, your own internal process, and you have kind of, you know, pulled your energy back a little bit. Maybe you're you're not even doing this intentionally. Maybe you're just on your own personal journey. You're pouring into yourself. You're loving on yourself here because your energy divine feminine is coming through extremely radiant, okay? I just keep getting radiant um, and just beauty. So literally whatever it is that you're doing internally could be manifesting, okay, physically for you here. But if your person were to be completely honest with you, this is making them feel some kind of way, okay? And I'm getting specifically that it's tied to how you engage your person. It's tied to a certain role that they have played in your life for such a long time. And they really begin to have a level of comfort around this. And just recently, there has been a shift it's almost as if like the rug had been pulled from under them. But I don't think for some of you this is intentional. But for the majority of, of the energy that I'm picking up on, Divine Feminine, you have just been really pouring into yourself. You have been loving on yourself. You have been, you know, engaging in your self-care routines, really taking care of yourself. And this is really starting to um, illuminate outwardly. 
and maybe your person feels as if you are not showing them enough attention you're not pouring into this connection right now um but they're watching you they feel your energy your energy is rising and the wow i just got something so clearly oddly enough this masculine is actually attracted to this like I said, their energy is literally coming through all over the place. So I'm getting clearly that they feel as if you've changed. This has them feeling a little uneasy. It has them feeling emotional, but they're also impressed with this. They also feel like good about this. They feel like this is a very attractive quality, whatever it is that you're doing here. I definitely feel like you are in this position of power. You are pouring back into yourself in some kind of way. And your person can definitely pick up on this. They can definitely feel this. Because there was a certain level of energy that you poured into them and into this connection, you're kind of pouring this into yourself right now. And they can feel this. They're not saying this to you, but I'm definitely feeling like you can pick up on, on their energy right now and you can feel that they feel some kind of way, but they're not going to say this to you. They're not going to express this to you, but they definitely feel it. And it's a weird kind of energy because it's actually, wow, I just got, it's actually turning them on a bit. But at the same time, it, it makes them feel a little bit threatened, okay, for some reason. And wow. Um, but whatever it is that you're doing, Divine Feminine, you have their full attention, okay? So with the I feel your energy card right here, maybe you were wondering if your person could pick up on what it was that you were doing. For some of you, I feel like that will be a confirmation, but it's like they want to express this to you, but maybe they don't want to come off a certain kind of way. They feel like if they tell you this, you'll maybe take it wrong, okay? Because they're kind of confused by this. They're actually turned on. They like this. Um, they like the fact that you're pouring more into yourself. They like this um, a lot, but they also, it's like really emotional. Like they feel kind of uneasy about this. Maybe they don't know what's happening. You know, naturally when you get to this place where you start to level up and you start to really pour into yourself, it's like more and more, it's like every single day you're becoming more and more um, of your true self. And this naturally will trickle down into every single area of your life. So naturally, this will affect your relationships. I feel like this is what your person is feeling. Maybe they feel as if your connection is going to be affected because it was pointed out that you kind of put this person in their own category. I'm feeling like you poured so much energy into them. Um, you gave them so much time, so much attention. They're used to kind of like a certain type of treatment from you. And now they're coming through saying, yeah, you changed. You know, things things aren't the same anymore. And it's in a way where, where they can feel it, even if you are at a distance from them. And depending on how energetically bonded you are, maybe they feel as if you're slipping away. Okay? But yeah, they're definitely saying that this is deeper than what it is that you're doing. It's deeper than what it is that you're saying right now. It's your energy that's emanating. It's your energy that's telling me every single thing I need to know. And they don't know how to verbally express this to you because, you know, how do you tell a person that, you know, you're changing and you're evolving and you're becoming so much more radiant and so much more beautiful and I love it and it turns me on, but... You know, it also makes me feel a little bit uneasy. I'm feeling all over the place. Like, how do you convey that message? So I definitely feel like this is some, this is their internal process. So if you are wondering how your person is currently viewing you while you are at a distance from them, they feel your energy. They feel as if you have changed. Something that you're doing, it's different. Maybe you have adopted a new routine. Okay, but your energy is being infused. I mean, your connection you are infusing your connection with new energy simply by you changing some type of routine. There's like some type of dance that you do, okay? Where things may have just been very, very cyclic for a while. Yeah, you've kind of shaken this energy up and they feel it. Let's get the next message here. Wow. The next message we have is 
I'm feeling a little jealous. Wow. So yeah, Divine Feminine, um, I feel like you are coming across very, very radiant. You're coming across very, very confident at this time. And this is definitely making your person feel some emotions that they haven't felt. I'm picking up especially that this masculine does not get jealous easily. It takes a lot for them to react in this manner. It takes a lot for these emotions to kind of arise. And they're actually pretty shocked that they're feeling these type of emotions simply off of your energy alone. But they definitely are feeling this. And because they're so confused about how it is that they're feeling, because it's mainly pointing out that the way that they're viewing you right now, they feel as if whatever this new thing that you're doing is extremely attractive to them. It's so attractive to them, it's kind of frustrating them, maybe because you are at a distance. It's something pointing out about the current state of your connection. But they're thinking to themselves like, wow, if I'm viewing the Divine Feminine this way, that everybody else has to be viewing the divine feminine this way as well, okay? It has them a little bit on edge. It has them very, very triggered right now, okay? So yeah, they want you to know that they're feeling jealous. They're feeling very territorial over your energy right now. They feel as if you are there. They feel as if, you know, they should be the only ones that have this type of access to you. I definitely feel like this masculine energy may be a little bit spoiled as it pertains to the time, the, the amount of time, the amount of energy, the amount of tension, attention that you've had on them, okay? Because the fact that you can, you know, pull back your energy a bit or maybe pour into yourself a little bit here, Maybe you're out, you're having fun, you're with friends. I don't know, even if you're at a distance from your masculine, I feel like the way that you are navigating your connection at this time versus how you have navigated the connection in the past, there's a vast difference. And they feel this. And I don't even feel like this is you being intentional. I really, really feel like this is you being very, very confident. This is you being very, very calm. This is you feeling like, you know what, if this is my person and if things are going to be, I'm not going to stress about it. You know, worry, being worried is really a wasted emotion. So I guess you have, you know, really assumed this position of being extremely confident in who you are and, you know, the connection regardless of what state it's in. I feel like you just have this energy of it is what it is. Maybe you're assuming this position of indifference at this time in your connection right now. But I definitely feel like whatever it is that you're doing, it's making your person feel very, very triggered, okay? Very, very triggered, very, very emotional. And this is kind of throwing them off a little bit. Let's get the next message here. Yeah, they're, they're very, very triggered. We have expect the unexpected, yeah. Um, not only is this masculine triggered, but this masculine is about to do something very, very impulsive, okay? Um, I feel like whatever it is that you've done, Divine Feminine, I don't know, I keep saying I don't know if this is intentional or unintentional because I feel like for some of you, this is intentional. For some of you, you have pulled your energy back, you have reclaimed your power, um, you are not in this position anymore where you feel as if you're going to wait on your person. You're enjoying your life, okay? And because of that, your energy is rising. You are becoming just more, maybe more social. You're putting yourself out there a little bit more. I just keep getting confidence. That's the main energy here, okay? And mentally, if your person is at a distance from you or if, if there's something going on in the connection right now, this is like their mental process. They feel as if they don't know how to kind of express this to you. It's like they want to show you. So your person is feeling jealous. And they're basically letting you know to expect the unexpected. They're, they're feeling very impulsive right now. I feel like you've shifted the dynamic 
from them being in a position of inaction to them immediately wanting to take action. For them feeling as if you've kind of for them feeling as if you kind of leveled the playing field. They don't feel like you put them in this in this special kind of category anymore. And this is not something that you're saying. They feel like they feel like your energy is directly telling them this. Even if you have not verbalized this, I'm getting you have not verbalized this. This is this is their internal process. So I don't know if they have eyes on you, okay, visually, maybe they have you on social media. Maybe you have a mutual friend group here, but they're reading you, they're observing you, they're paying very, very close attention. This is someone who knows you very, very well, and they're picking up on your energy, and this is what your energy is telling them, if this is resonating with you so far. So it's kind of like they're coming through letting you know, like, expect the unexpected, okay? Your energy is kind of throwing them off so much that they, like, have to do something. It's like they have to show you how it is that they feel. You're moving them um, to take kind of inspire action towards you. This is someone who is determined. And I don't even feel like, you know, this is coming from a malicious place or whatever. Um, as far as them feeling like a little territorial or whatever that is. It's like they're coming through letting you know, like, it's kind of like they, they love you and they don't want anyone else to kind of access your energy in this way. It's making them feel like you're changing and it's making them think of if you're changing so much, what does this mean for our connection? What does this mean for our relationship? How how do we move forward like this? Okay. And for some reason, this, this person has a problem with being very, very emotional. And I think it's centered around the fact that they don't get very jealous often. So they're probably like, what would this divine feminine feel if I showed them this side of me? You know, would that push them away a little bit? They don't really know. They really don't know how you would handle this, but they're basically letting you know that they're feeling extremely impulsive right now. It's kind of like they have, the dynamic has shifted and now your person is in this energy of them like wanting to kind of win you, okay? Wanting to kind of like woo you, wanting to kind of, and, you know, I'm just getting take you out. I'm getting, like, they really want to, like, be with you physically. They really want to put time in physically here. And maybe they feel as if whatever it is that you're doing is a threat to this connection. I don't get that this is something that you verbalize to them, but they feel this way strongly at this time. Okay? So let's go ahead and get the next message here. Yeah, so the next message we have is, you're mine forever. So this is definitely how they're feeling at this time right now. It's kind of like they want to send you a reminder to let you know that, you know, you still kind of belong to them. Okay, they're feeling very territorial about you. And I feel like whatever this new energy is, is kind of causing them to self-reflect. It's really infused your connection with brand new energy. And you are about to see this. You're about to witness just how much, just how serious this masculine is, okay? Their energy is coming across very, very serious at this time. Because whatever it is that you're doing is really, really messing with their minds. And it's causing them to take action, right? So even though you're changing, they're like, okay, you're changing. Well, we're changing. Okay, I feel like they're about to show you, you know, that they, they can do the same thing that you're doing here. Um, it's like they, they're like, no, we're, we're in this together. Okay, yeah. Your person is, is really paying attention to a lot of the things. They're seeing the effects of your hard work, Divine Feminine. And it's really lighting a fire up under them, which could be a good thing. This could be a good thing, okay? So I definitely feel like um, you're moving to the next level. I feel like this connection is moving to the next level. But your masculine wants you to know that, yeah, you're theirs forever, okay? Regardless of what happens, regardless of the shifts that, the shifts that happen within this connection here, um, 
they're in this position where they are a little jealous, okay, um, of the attention that you may be getting at this time. But this jealousy is kind of driving them to, to show how much they care about you. To show, you know, those other masculines out there that may have their eyes on you that you are theirs. And that's how strongly their energy is coming through at this time. So you may definitely feel heavy, heavy energy from your person. You may be seeing a lot of signs and sinks because they are very, very consumed with thoughts of you at this time and paying very close attention to you. Very close attention to you, okay? So these are the messages that I have for you all today. If you resonated with this message, be sure to hit the like button on the way out. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye.